Citizen Lab report, CCP is coordinated online assault on Dr. Yan, the most lethal person to the CCP. Introduction, hello everyone, and welcome to the Capture, the intelligence channel. Today we're going to be talking about a groundbreaking report from the Citizen Lab at the University of Toronto. This report exposes a massive CCP-backed operation involving over a hundred overseas websites engaged in coordinated attacks against critics of the Chinese regime. We'll delve into the details of this operation, its targets, methods, and implications. So without further ado, let's get started. Unveiling the CCP is online propaganda machine. The Citizen Lab report, titled Paper Wall, Chinese websites posing as local news outlets, target global audiences with pro-Beijing content, sheds light on a sophisticated network of websites operated from within China. These websites masquerade as local news outlets outlets in over 30 countries spanning Europe, Asia, and Latin America. Their primary objective is to target individuals and organizations critical of the CCP, launching coordinated attacks and spreading disinformation to discredit and silence them. Modus operandi, a web of deception and manipulation. The report reveals that this operation is orchestrated by a Shenzhen-based company called Kimei Yanzian Media Company Ltd. Hai Mai, Hai Mai operates it's under the guise of a private media company, but its true purpose is to wage a covert propaganda war on behalf of the CCP. Hai Mai's websites employ a variety of tactics to deceive and manipulate their audiences. They publish seemingly innocuous content, such as political news, crime stories, and entertainment articles to attract readers and establish a veneer of legitimacy. However, interspersed within this seemingly harmless content are insidious attacks on the CCP is critics, often accompanied by ad hominem attacks and unsubstantiated claims, targeted attacks, silencing dissent and undermining credibility. The report highlights that the primary target of these attacks is Dr. Yan Lim, a renowned virologist and whistleblower who has been vocal in her criticism of the CCP's handling of the COVID-19 pandemic. Dr. Yan's research and public statements have been met with relentless attacks from the CCP. CCP and its proxies, including the websites operated by Hai Mai. The attacks against Dr. Yan take various forms, including character assassination attempts to discredit her scientific findings and efforts to undermine her credibility and reputation. These attacks are not limited to online platforms. They have also manifested in real-world harassment and intimidation. Beyond online attacks, coordinated efforts to silence critics, the citizen lab report emphasizes that the CCP's online attacks are not isolated incidents. They are part of a broader strategy to silence dissent and suppress criticism both online and offline. This strategy includes coordinated efforts to organize protests, file lawsuits, and launch smear campaigns against critics of the CCP. The report provides evidence of Hai Mai's involvement in organizing protests and rallies against Dr. Yan and other critics of the CCP. These protests are often staged in front of universities, research institutions, or media outlets where the targeted individuals work or have been invited to speak. Implications and countermeasures The Citizen Lab report exposes the CCP's systematic and coordinated efforts to undermine its critics and manipulate public opinion. This operation represents a serious threat to freedom of expression and the integrity of the global information landscape. Countering this threat requires a multifaceted approach. Governments, social media platforms, and civil society organizations must work together to expose and disrupt these propaganda networks. Additionally, individuals must remain vigilant and critical of the information they consume online, recognizing and rejecting disinformation campaigns. The Citizen Lab report serves as a wake-up call, highlighting the urgent need to address the CCP's coordinated online attacks on its critics by shedding light on the tactics and infrastructure used by the CCP to spread disinformation and suppress dissent. The report empowers us to take action and defend the principles of free speech and truth. If you found this video helpful, remember to like, share, and destroy that subscribe button. Also, stay tuned for the latest current affairs on the Capture the Intelligence channel. Together, we can expose the truth 
and hold the CCP accountable for its actions.